Three, two, one. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the R&D Ballistics Lab. I just want to start this by saying that my favorite Nerf gun of all time is the Strongarm. It's a six shooter revolver, ton of fun to play with and decently accurate, but it does not satiate my lust for power. So in order to remedy that, Ryan and I went ahead and made a giant Nerf bazooka that's going to be absolutely terrifying to use. It takes these two and a half inch diameter Nerf darts, which are painted to look exactly like the Strongarm darts. Now we've actually never tried this thing, so we have no idea if it's going to work, but we're going to change all of that today. So join us as we find out how powerful this Nerf bazooka truly is. We have the universally despised cultural archetype, the jabroni. Who's the bros of now, bitch? <laughs> Shooting in three, two, one. This is uh, Google's next revision of their Google Glass. <laughs> Low blow. This is the Nerf tip right here. That's PVC and that crack. Check out the Nerf dart too. Absolute destruction. Look, look, there's a nice dent right here. That's why it broke. Next up, we have a tasty watermelon. Who's the tastiest melon in the meadow now, bitch? Watermelon in three. Two, one. <laughs> I fucking missed. I can't shoot for shit. In three, two, one. Oh, it's too far to the right. What? Okay, if this doesn't work, we only have one dart left. Burn in watermelon hell. In three, two, one. Get some! Victory's never tasted sweeter! Ah. You guys want some melon? That has burn marks on it. Yeah, it's a little roasted. Some roasted melon. Oh, that's not very good. For our next target, we have my old Xbox 360 that I've wasted so many hours of my life on. I'm sorry, but you're just not the one. And to shoot it, we have Frazier. Yeah, he's our friend who's been filming this whole video. In case you didn't notice, there was a guy in the background. <laughs> in three. Two, one. <laughs> you okay? What the hell, dude? That's how you do a proper teardown video. Ah, what's in here? That's where it made impact, right there. Aside from the plastic casing, this still might be usable. You want to throw Halo in here and find out? No, I'm good. How you feeling, man? You got a little nervous tick going on here, twisting yeah, the microphone. That was insanely powerful. I put it on my hip, trying to shoot it from there so I could actually get some balance and aim it. And the thing just kicked back and ripped me right in my bone. You got a bruise too. Yeah. Oh not man, you just cut skin. That's for my girlfriend. Yeah. She's really beautiful. <laughs> Thanks for bringing up the sore subject. Good job. Good job on making that. 
All right, guys, the bazooka's in the shop for some overhaul. I think we're also gonna add some foam pads to protect Fraser's delicate bones. Yeah, if you like that video, we have a lot more coming down the pipeline, so hit the subscribe button. And if you wanna see us shoot the bazooka at each other, then hit the thumbs up button. Nah, we're not gonna do that. But if you have a cool idea for what we could shoot it at, leave a comment down below. We're not gonna shoot each other, though. Uh -huh. You saw what happened. This guy's crazy. All right, <laughs> see you next time.